in this next test, this is for the chloride anion. I've already got my chloride substance in the test tube. I'm going to add in my distilled water to dissolve. So about a third of the test tube. And we'll stir that. Once again, we're going to be forming another precipitate in this test, so we want to be sure that all of our solid substance is dissolved so we can see the true formation of a precipitate and not be confused by undissolved substance. Okay, that looks pretty good. Can always add in more distilled water to clear that up. And next, we're going to add in 10 drops of the um, nitric acid. So we got 10 drops. And then we're going to add in. Also, two drops of the silver nitrate. Remember that this substance here can stain your skin and clothes, so you want to be careful that you do not get this on you. One, two. And immediately you see that white precipitate form. Once again, it's slightly different than the lead precipitate because it forms a solid chunk. Um, whereas in the lead precipitate, it formed a ring and then began that immediate snowfall. So slightly different, but this is the positive result for a chloride anion.